So uh, here we have Takahashi Hiyoshi, the scriptwriter of Ring, and he will be uh, having a master class today and about J-Horror. Okay, so let's start with the interview. Okay. Uh, you studied rational literature at university. Why did you choose that degree and did it influence your works? で、学ではロシア文学を学んだということですが、その専攻を選んだ理由と、またロシア文学を高さの作品に影響を与えましたか。はい。ね、まずあのロシア文学を選んだ理由は、えっと、高校生の時にあのセルガイエゼンシュテ
あ作品を作るのに特別なメソッド小説を映画にするときは小説っていうのはあの複雑なことを複雑なまま書けるし、はい、それが読者に伝わる、うん、あの表現形式なんだけど映画は複雑なことを複雑なまま描くと観客に伝わらないんで、うん、複雑なことが背景にあるんだけどこれをいかにシンプルな形にするかなんですね。でそれはそのシンプルな形にするためにはちょっと小説の内容を裏切らなきゃいけないというのもあるんだけどもそれで原作者ともう一回することがあるんだけどあのリムの場合鈴木さんがさっき言ったようにおまかせだったんで全然その問題はなくあのシンプルな形にできたんですだから小説の言語を映画の言語に考案する変換するっていうのはいかにシンプルにするかそこが一番大事なポイントなんです。Um, so for Ring,、uh, Ring was written by, originally written by、uh, Koji Suzuki, and、um, the reason for that to become a movie was because、um, Suzuki watched Joyude, which was、um, directed by Takahashi, and、uh, he was very、um, inspired by Joyude, and he called the Joyude team to request them to make the movie for Ring. And so,、um, for the company called Kadokawa, which is, was in charge for the ring,、um, usually the writer has the most um, um, authority. And so,、um, this time, Suzuki was very free and very、uh, flexible about、um, the team to make the movie. So, he didn't have any requests or conditions. So, that was. Why、um, the Joyude team was able to write the script、um, all over again, like in a movie way, and、uh, make their own ring freely. And I think that's why、uh, the ring was such a success. And for the special, unique working method,、um, For novels, novels can be written with a lot of、uh, details and Um, sometimes it may seem confused, but then the words were, are、um, fully understood by the readers. But then, when it gets to movies,、uh, if the expressions are、uh, complicated, it is very hard for the readers to understand. So, we have to make things simple in a movie way. So,、um, but for Ring,、uh, Suzuki was very flexible about us to change our. Um, expressions, so we were able to eliminate some parts from the、uh, novel and、uh, make our own、uh, simple way of the ring. <laughs> well, yeah, the theme.、Uh, what do you think about the present situation of J horror? Eh, the second J horror, I think, do you think? Ah, eh, to. あの日本の観客はもう J ホラー的な表現がもうあのビデオ市場とかにもう溢れ出てしまってそれからあと YouTube とかにもあの心霊動画みたいなものが溢れ出てしまっててもうすっかり飽和状態で飽きてしまってるんで今 J ホラー的な映画を作る日本でね作ることはあのかなり難しいというかもうだ,だいぶその生き声が衰えてきてる。で J ホラーを見た海外の人たちが例えば韓国とかが、えー、と J ホラー的な映画を作,る作りたいっていうことであの日本国内の僕とかその J ホラー作ってる人たちに声をかけて一緒にあの仕事をしたりしてるんですけど今は、うん、主にアジア圏でねあの中国とかも仕事してるんですけどやっぱりその J ホラー的な部分を求めてるって言われてるんだけどもいざ。中国や韓国に行って仕事を始めるとやっぱりその国の風土にあったものを求められると結構ねあのジェネホラー的なものってや,やっぱあんまりこう,うまくあのなじまないなっていうのが正直なところですねだから結構あのジェネホラーは海外に強い影響を与えたんだけどそれをそのままなんかやろうとしてもやっぱり。難しいやっぱ海外では海外ないのその国ない,ないのやり方を見つけないとダメなんだなっていうのを最近実感してます
So uh, in Japan, the J horror expression is overflowing. Um, there's a lot of uh, videos um, out already, and on YouTube, there's a lot of haunted videos out. So um, the Japanese audience are pretty uh, tired of the J horror and horror. So the um, J horror industry in Japan is um, beginning to slow down, but. Um, the foreign countries, especially in Asia, are requesting us to um, cooperate with them to create a movie that is similar with J-Horror. And we are cooperating with such as uh, South Korea, Taiwan. But um, the difficulty is that we cannot make J-Horror in a foreign country. Um, J-Horror is matching with Japanese culture, so when we were to make a, a horror movie in their matching their culture, it will be difficult to uh, combine J horror and their culture together. The last one. Hi. Can you tell us something in advance about the film you're going to present tonight? Why did you decide to take inspiration from Lovecraft's work? あの、上映されるキュッシャイ社のキャロルの上映前にちょっとあのお客さんに伝えたいことなどありましたらお願いします。あとあのなぜラブクラフトの作品からインスピレーションを受けようと思ったのかっていうお話をいただけますか。これは
I wanted to express the young uh, directors as the Kyushi Haisha um, being um, destroyed by the um, the the elders, um, the um, the older directors with more experience, and which is the reality of the. Um, film industry today, so I just wanted to express that through the taste of um, this parody song. Thank you so much. Thank you.